This is Twit. Um, all right. I'm sorry. I lost track. Where are we? What are we doing? Nano Banana Pro. What are we doing here? Which I've been playing with. It's astonishing. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable good. I only mention it because I feel like there's some people who are still like, oh, Google's losing it. And it's like, uh, you might want to start paying attention to this one. Like the (laughs) Nano Banana Pro stuff is like, yikes. Like it's yikes. And, um. I guess I misunderstood this. I, when they first came out with this, I thought it was specifically about um, taking a still image and making a video out of it. But mm-hmm. it's actually oh, also no, it's just, just image everything. generation, general yeah. image generation. It's it's rather incredible. In fact, the big, the only big complaint I've seen about it is it might be a little too realistic. <laughs> it's like, yeah. this thing's working really good. Um, well, so well this, and this Gemini 3 is also really, really good. Yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, Google has been sandbagging us i think <laughs> right no, i think they well, really poured some energy into it i would argue the biggest thing they did right with gemini 3 is actually hired some pr people to properly promote it oh, maybe that's they had, they had been botching this not out of that but this what this time they had the influencers involved like they did all the things to make it show in its best light it helps that it also is pretty darn good it's but, really good yeah and I, yeah. I that's the thing like i yeah, the narratives th- thus far has been like they've been face rigging it since Microsoft came out with Copilot. But it's like, well, yeah, I don't know. They invented yeah. a lot of the stuff. Remember, <laughs> you know, yeah. like I, but even even in that Sydney Bard days, yeah, when you actually took away the drama and counted right. the errors and mistakes, and both of them were having problems. It's just that I think right. Microsoft handled the PR well, and we were ignoring them, and Google wasn't, and we caught every one of them. That's and right. and it, to me, that's just like, it's tough to strip away. You've got to, the power of the polish matters here. Yep. And, and it's because they were actually I, I, measuring the quality of these things. Not that easy. I don't remember if I said this last week, but when I, uh, people, sorry, I made a Lord of the Rings map out of this show. <laughs> okay. With oh nano banana pro. Oh boy. This is the type of thing it's really good at. So it's really good at infographics, which this is yeah. not a good example of. But no, but it's look at that. <laughs> I just pasted the not, the notion uh, outline. Baines is rolling in a grave right now. But you know, <laughs> it, uh, wow. And look at that. Run his radio Christmas gifts. Get ready, kids. This is exciting. Mm-hmm. Oh, don't look it down in the corner. Although. <laughs> This is this is yep. it talking about That's itself. So <laughs> Google's lead. So this funny. is really uh and here's like the the results you just did in Hardware Islands. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and, it, so it's, funny. and it did that in a in like 20 seconds. I know. That's it's, crazy. Darren says one of the things he likes to do with it is uh use Claude uh code to get an assessment of the code and then feed the assessment into nano banana pro to do an infographic nice. and he says it's amazing <laughs> i love it it's amazing i'm uh, i'm enjoying uh the uh the yep. ai life i gotta tell you yeah google said nice little comeback here yeah. um by the way so everyone. has anthropic they released four or five this you know mm-hmm. a few yeah. days later yeah. we're in a that's race the, right now that's the thing i thank goodness I, don't we, there's no version of this where one week we're like yep we have a winner it's like we have a no, winner no. now like mm-hmm. give it a week like it's, it's gonna be different exciting it's, it's, it reminds me of like 2011 browser wars right yeah and with uh ie9 and the, those versions of chrome and just the emergence of javascript in yep. full force and starting to do render engines like just every release <laughs> you were awed how much better it got and how much better it got and now we're in this we, uh, these guys are starting to figure out what we're actually using it for and making yeah. sure it, it does that better it does that good yeah exactly it's just worth looking at if you haven't seen like i just feel like some people out there are like uh i've had a little ai fatigue i'm sure this is great yeah. like no, I, I don't think a it was little I, I don't think <laughs> I the other thing is like google has done an amazing job of getting this stuff but and by this stuff i mean whatever their ai thing is at the time into every one of their products and services as quickly as possible it's incredible mm-hmm. And even a, like a third-party partner like Adobe, which is using now a let's, lets you use in addition to their Firefly models, third-party models, already has Nano Banana Pro and Gemini 3 available. So if you're paying Adobe a lot of money every month, um, you can use it there too. <laughs> so it's it's kind of, it's in Google Photos, it's in Notepad, uh, Notebook LM, it's, it's everywhere. It's like everywhere. It's unbelievable. So um, yeah, it's pretty cool. And then I... I usually just use Microsoft Designer. In fact, I 
I don't think about it that much, but this is obviously the co-pilot based uh, image generation stuff, which, you know, has gotten better over time too, but I was doing some of this, like the thing, the graphic Leo made is a great example, actually, just that kind of look and feel like that infographic look mm -hmm. is, uh, that's the first time I've been like, I got to figure out a way to how I could use this. Like, I really like, I just like the style, you know, like I have map, we have a, that eternal spring book I have with my wife. We have maps of, you know, Mexico city that are based on Google maps and like, they're okay, you know, but I was like, oh, we could make a Tolkien map out of this. Like, that'd be kind of fun, you know, or whatever. Like. I'd like to, I'm going to, I'm going to start. With yeah, that. you can. I mean, it's, I mean, but it's, it's almost, I almost feel like I'm not creative enough <laughs> to use it. Right. It's like, oh, I'm just doing more Tolkien maps. There's so many things here. I don't know why you need anything other than a Tolkien map, but that's okay. okay. Um, <laughs> that's <laughs> that's true. Good to me. I like it. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this little highlight from a much better show <laughs> and longer too called Windows Weekly. The whole link to the show is right below me. And of course, we stream live right here every Wednesday. You can watch us do our thing or download it here or in your favorite podcast player. Uh, best thing to do, what do they say? Uh, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.